Now to create a transition code, copy this program name and open a new session SE93. So here, for example, I want to give the key code name as ZPO underscore detail. Click on create. Give the sort text here like purchase order display and based on our requirement, we have to select required radio button. So here we can go with like program and selection screen report on the shrink code. Press enter. Here add the program name ZDemo underscore P underscore report. Select all these checkbox and click on save button. Again, system is asking for a package. If you want to transfer this report, enter package or create as a local object. Okay, so I am saving this in the same request number. Press enter. Now transition code ZPO underscore detail is created. So what we can do now to run that program, we just enter here ZPO underscore detail. See, with the same transition code, we are able to execute the same program. Okay, because the end user, they run with this transition code. So for custom report, your basis team will assign this transition code to your users and they will able to access this. Now once our development is done, as we have learned from scratch how to create the LV report, we have already assigned transition code. Now once your testing is successfully done, the next task come is transfer this to from development to quality system. So here I don't have a quality system, but I will just explain the process. So once testing is done, what we have to do? Go to SC09. And if you know the request number, click on display. Enter the request number here. Okay, press enter. And what we have to do? We have to release the request. So inside this request, you can see all the object. Like we have created one program and one transition code. So we can see all the objects which we have stored inside this. So what we have to do, we have to select this and click on this release icon. So this will release our transport request. Okay, from the development system, we have to release and in the quality system, we have to import this. So like this, we have to release from the, our system and then your base system will import in the quality and the production system. So this is completely start to end task of a web developer to create LV report from selection screen to output we have learned. We also learn how to assign transition code and we also learn how to release the request once our development is completed and then we can share with this request number the transport manager who want to move this request to the quality and the production system. So in this way, we successfully won this session on creating a report. Thank you.